Welcome back to Tasty Travels. I'm Travis Fry. Today we find ourselves in Pilot Mountain, North Carolina, checking out a place that's serving real deal barbecue. This is All Sauced Up Barbecue. So we're in All Sauced Up Barbecue where you get more pork on your fork. And we're talking with owners Steve and Janet. Uh, Steve is going to be going off and cooking us some delicious food, so we'll let him get to it. But while he's doing that, we're going to talk to Janet about the history of All Sauced Up Barbecue. So Janet, um, I first got to ask, how did you get into the restaurant business? Well, it started out begin with it started out him cooking up on a mountain on his porter pit and he done so well with it he says if we can find a restaurant we're going to open a restaurant so we found this one here in pilot it's got the smokehouse and that's what we needed and so we started it in 2020 enjoyed every minute of it and each year it's got a lot better and you guys work really hard to provide good quality food. What are some of your specialties here? Our biggest specialty is barbecue cheese fries. Uh, it seems like everybody loves the barbecue cheese fries. It's a big plate and it's very hearty. And most of our food here is big quantities. So nobody goes away hungry. And we do a lot of business food the week with all the facilities and stuff around that come and eat. We have some people that come two to three times a day uh, to eat with us. And uh, it's, it's been a blessing to us. So when you come in, you may be a stranger, but you leave as family. Absolutely. That's the way we want it. All right. Well, I'm looking forward to getting back there and seeing what Steve is going to cook up for us. So let's head back to the kitchen and see what kind of great food they're cooking up. Okay, so for the barbecue, what, what process goes into that barbecue? Anywhere from eight to 10 hours of cooking each each day. Um, Do you use hickory wood or is it? Yes, we use mostly hickory. Okay, Sometimes that's going to make it smell, taste really good. Taste really good. And I got to say, now, a lot of places uh, we go, they like to do uh, their signature sauces. What kind of signature sauce do you have on this? It took me about 14 years because I'd do a little bit, you know, and I wasn't happy with it and I wasn't happy with it. And then I finally dialed it into what I thought was. Wow. was that is a labor of love right there. 14 years in the making. I can't wait to try it. I know our cameraman's salivating over it right now. So we'll get to that in just a second. But the other thing that you guys are known for is being on the Ground State Trail. And that is a local trail within Surrey County that features 11 restaurants all throughout the county that serve Ground State. And all Ground Steak, we have found out, is different when it comes to the different restaurants on how they prep it and how they serve it. And isn't this very unique to Surrey County? You know, you go outside of Surrey County, you don't find a lot of restaurants that make this. No, you do not. And how long did it take you to come up with making a ground steak? I don't know. Not trial and error? Trial and error, and then somebody just going ding. <laughs> Man, this looks absolutely phenomenal, Steve. Now this is this is going to be great. I can just tell you right now, when the barbecue glistens, that's when you know it's good and tender. Very good food. Okay, now that's dynamite because you got a little bit of heat, you got a little bit of sweet. The cheese makes it really nice, and it gives a little bit of salt. That is a good hearty meal. I recommend their salt and pepper catfish, their baby back ribs, uh, barbecue chicken, barbecue plate. It's so good right there. It's got some great sweetness to it. And it's got uh, some great uh, some great thickness to it as well. Love good baked beans. And then our final one that we're going to check out is this. This is kind of the signature piece. This is on the Ground Steak Trail. Folks, if you've seen the brochure of the Ground Steak Trail, this was the picture they used for the front cover of the Ground Steak Trail. So this, I know, is going to be absolutely wonderful. And I was talking to Janice. Janice was saying that a lot of this is local. So you get your meat local, your uh, produce is local in town. So you know that it's going to be great. And it's going to be an example of Surrey County. So let's give it a whirl. That is perfect consistency. When you think of a loose meat sandwich, it's just loose enough that it holds itself together. And then you've got the salt. You hit, instantly are hit with the pepper. And then, of course, that tomato makes it nice and gives it a little bit of lift. Absolutely wonderful. Come on out and join them and eat. They treat you like family. That's going to do it for Tasty Travels. I'm Travis Fry. Come hungry. You're going to leave happy. Tasty Travels is brought to you by the Surrey County Tourism Development Authority. 
and by encouraging Surrey County to buy local and by viewers like you. Thank you. For more information, visit yakinvalleyandc.com.